let's let's talk about a Merry Christmas now. This is a Christmas massacre. We have we have here Satan Claus. He's a good man, as you can see. His horns are dripping with blood, as well as his mace and his axe, which he has used to sever the head of one of the gingerbread men who lives in this lovely house. Um, what happened is this white trash family uh, had told their children that Santa did not exist and the children were going back to school and saying that uh, Santa didn't exist while they're friends so Santa came and has wreaked havoc. Here we have the mother. Um, she was with child at the time of her killing. Here she is attached with the umbilical cord still into her severed stomach. It's been torn open with some sort of uh, knife or sword. You can see the maggots feasting on her on her insides. There's a little elf who's uh, eating the fetus. Uh, the mother is holding a cross. She was praying to Jesus Christ, I imagine, for forgiveness and for help, but alas, that help uh, did not come. As you can see, the trail of blood leading into the house. She had been dragged out by the elf before he um, ravaged her body. Here we have another elf who's taken a uh, push mower and is going to work on the head of what could be an older brother or possibly the father. Um, this elf before the rampage had a little too much speed and whiskey and is now puking into the Jesus fish. He's being poked by his uh, friend elf. Here's Santa's steed chewing on one of the little children, one of the babies of the family. Um, you'll note that the elves are marked by their red bleeding eyes. This elf here has run over has run over um, one of the children and oh, a nice Christmas tree, that's nice. The chimney it seems is bleeding um, oh and here we have a child stuck on the weather vane, he's been impaled and he's bleeding quite profusely the blood is indeed dripping down the house let's see what else do we have here um, well, if you look around here by the tree you see an elf with a machine gun. Uh, he's just finished going to work on one of the children. Oh, this tree's about to fall over, but that's okay. Here it seems one of the elves didn't quite make it. He's impaled on on the tree. Oh, this little this little tyke is hanging. You can see he's been shot in the head. Blood dripping on the on the snow. Shot in the head by this this surly looking elf. Oh, with the shoulder mounted rocket launcher. That's that's special. Oh, the cross. The cross is bleeding. Bleeding for the lost innocence of the entire Christmas season and this poor, poor family. You can see the tree also is bleeding uh, for the sins of the family. And if we move around back, moving around back, we will see that another one of the older members of the family uh, has been severed in half by a Christmas tree most likely launched in the air by this little fella. Hey there little guy. Yeah. Well, that uh, just about wraps up the tour of this Christmas massacre. Oh, a pentagram, of course. What would a massacre be without, without a pentagram? That's nice. Here's the laneway leading into the house where the massacre started. It's all quite beautiful. I guess the moral of the story, the lesson to be learned here is have a little faith. Merry Christmas.